I'm looking at the jumper laptop that comes with uh, four gigabyte of DDR3 SD RAM, 128 gigabyte solid state drive. And it's got a 11.6 inch screen. Uh, there's the uh, power packed into foam. Let's uh, take that. It's got a 10 point touch screen. Um, tabs come off there. Uh, peels off, what do you think? That peels off. As an Intel Apollo Lake N3350 dual core processor. Now I shall uh, start it up and set it up, and then without a doubt it will need Windows updates, so I shall run it through them and then uh, give it a good test. Let's just have a look. There's keyboard protection on there. Got the manual here. It. I'll peel this off. Looks like a screen protector on there. Right, let's plug it in. Give it its first start up. As I say, I shall run through the start up um, and install the updates, and then I shall give it a good test out. That's now set up, um, as I say, I shall run through it and run the updates on it and that, um, and uh, come back and give it a good try out. Now I've been using it for a bit, um, it's got a good sturdy aluminium case, the key's fairly positive, it weighs about 1.5 kilogram, um, the uh, memory on it, so you've got a EMMC drive 64 gig and you've got the uh, SSD which is empty for whatever you're going to put on it of uh, 64 gig so we've got Edge browser comes as standard um, so we're going to run some YouTube Keypad's pretty good, nice and positive. And we've got some 4K stuff to look at. An advert to have to watch. So we're looking at it full screen. That's full screen on it. And of course, it flips over. So you can stand it flat. The keyboard disables once you uh, flip it over. 
flip it over. Oh, that's me pressing the screen. You can have it as a pad, touch pad. To normal mode. Let's turn it over. Let's go to tablet mode. The game. Seems reasonable on games. Uh, I mean, you're not going to be running, uh, you know, heavy duty games on it, but uh, things probably like Minecraft or Roblox would be fine. Not very good at these, so don't expect a lot. It's better than I normally do. Let's come out of that. Touch screen's fairly uh, responsive. Pretty good. Zoom. Yeah. Overall, I yeah like it. It's nice. And uh, I shall come back with my review.